This video is proudly sponsored by chaoscards.co.uk. Be sure to check out the description for more links and information. I'm hungry. But now when I'm hungry, I can put my food in this Pokemon lunchbox! Yay! But all joking aside, this is the newly released Pokemon treasure chest. They, I think they've only released four of these before. They tend to be one a year, but this one is quite strange because they only just released the last one in what? Was it November? So... I don't know why they're bringing out another one so soon after that. I'm guessing just because it's Generation 7, or maybe just to like reuse this artwork because this is from the uh, Japanese Elite Trainer Boxes, and I'm pretty sure that these are like from Japanese Steam Decks or whatever. But yeah, you get a bunch of goodies in this chest, including three promos, which we're gonna get to in a bit. I wasn't actually gonna get this at first because it has those promos on them which were of course already um, featured in the Alola collection, so I thought it's really weird that they're reusing them. We got a load of other goodies in there, but something made me change my mind on getting this. So, we shall see. But there are five packs in every single one of these boxes. I think the packs can differ by region in um, various steel products, so I can't really tell you what they, um, they're gonna be. There's probably gonna be at least a one or two of Sun and Moon base, which is great. But, let's see what awaits inside this magical chest thingy. And it's all falling apart, haha. <laughs> but, if we get the beautiful promos out, they're different! I'm so happy, like, I don't understand why they've got artwork of, um, of these ones on the front, because, uh, I don't know, it's weird! Because that's not what's inside the chest! And I don't even know where these have come from either, are they like from some older theme deck? I don't know, but... It seems that these promos have just come out of nowhere and I'm really happy for it because they just look so good. The colors are vibrant. They are probably my favorite starter promos that I've seen this generation and there are a ton of them. I think there are like four different sets, so yeah. But let's see what's inside the box. So first up, we've got these special edition pencils, which is really cool. I uh, tend to use the uh, eraser on it for um, the map in Lucky Mail, so I guess uh, you'll start seeing these soon enough. But ah, uh, they're really cute. I think it's got the same artwork as on the promos, actually. Or does it? No, it's the same artwork that's on the back of the, um, the chest. But as a standard, you get a couple of sticker sheets. I didn't know that these were sticker sheets at first, but they definitely are because if you try and like lift it up a bit, that's a sticker, but they're so cute and I don't know where to put them. <laughs> oh, they're so precious, but this is a really, really cool sheet of Solgaleo and Lunala. I just like butchered Solgaleo's name. I don't know why. Got this really, really cool notepad. Ooh, I still haven't even gotten through my um, McGinna one, so <laughs> that's something. But, ooh, we also got um, one of these mini, mini binders. They're like the smallest things ever. <laughs> and I don't really know what to put in these because I find that certain binders can make the cards go warped. And I'm not really sure about this one. I don't think that this one does, but I know that I do have a small binder. And whenever I put cards in them, they go all like wrinkly, or at least the sleeves do. I don't know why. But the rest of the chest is empty except for... Boosters! Or rather, five boosters! Haha, <laughs> I, I made a bad joke, I'm sorry. But these are indeed the um, the packs that are on the front, so yeah, let's uh, get into them. I think I'm gonna go in preferred order, so, well, least preferred order, so, Fates Collide first, then two of Steam Siege, and then two of Sun and Moon! Ooh! There are still so many cards that I don't have from Sun and Moon, but it's not really any wonder because uh, there are just like a million different secret rares and I guess that's how it's gonna be from now on. But in this pack of fates there's Ordinary Spirit Link, Wigglytuff, Helix Fossil Omanyte, Minchino, Snubble, Dealing, Riolu, Jigglypuff, oh reverse rare bronzong, that's pretty neat. And then the rare is an Omastar regular. Oh well. I don't think I have this in uh, reverse, so that's pretty nice. Let's put that to the side. But yeah, Steam Siege. I actually ended up opening a couple of uh, Steam Siege blisters off camera, and this pack is not opening. The plastics like come off it. That's really quite strange. And I got probably the most insane blister of my entire life. <laughs> like, um, there are three packs in the blister, and I got one hollow, a full art, and a secret rare. Never had anything like that before, and I don't know if I will again. 
for Joltik, Tangler, Pornyard, Oshawott, uh, Nidoran, the reverse is a Krogunk, and the rare is Galvantula. Alright, tell me in the comments, does this look like it's shiny? It really doesn't to me, I don't know. I mean, Galvantula isn't exactly one of those shinies that looks incredibly different to begin with, so it's all good, but still. Alright, but... Pack number two of Steam Siege. And there is so much whitening on that card. What? What are you doing in the factory? <laughs> Lampin, Clang, Captivating Pokepuff, Tangler, Ponyard, Oshawott, Nidoran, Fungus, Reverse Rufflet, and then Nidoking, Regular Rare. So, ooh, that's not too good. We're halfway through the, the chest and nothing, which is a real shame. I really hope that we do get something for five packs, because that would be really unlucky otherwise. <laughs> but in this pack of Sun and Moon, there's Professor Kukui, Golbat, Repel, Psyduck, Mount Sweet, Lillipup, Dratini, Wingle, the reverse is Stuffle, and then the rare is Decidui. What the heck? This has been really bad. Unless there's like something amazing in this pack, I'm going to be kind of disappointed, but oh well. You can't always be lucky with everything. <laughs> but I could hope, right? I could hope. <laughs> Will this pack be magic? But it has Hal, Pissimian, uh, Rotom Dex, Makuhita, Biro, ugh, Grubbin, ugh, Drowsy. <laughs> it's so cold, so I can't move the cards. The reverse is Snubble, and then the rare is a Golduck Regular. Wow! Really, really below average pulls. Nothing out of five packs? Wow, that's probably like one of my worst openings ever. What the heck? But it is definitely, definitely worth it for these promos, I would say. Um, if you're going to buy a sealed product like this, then definitely buy it for the promos because a lot of the time you can get loose packs at a better price anyway because what you're paying for is, well, all the extra goodies inside. So at least if you don't get any good pulls, you got these really cool things. But yeah, I want to give a massive, massive thank you to um, my new sponsors, Chaos Cards, because this video would not be possible without them. So yeah, for UK people like me, please uh, check out the links down below because uh, you could get some good prices because it's like really hard to get good prices in the UK on card merch and their prices are a lot better than anything you can get in like stores. So yeah. <laughs> I think I rambled on a little bit too much, but yeah, thank you very much for watching as always, and I will see you next time. Bye!